called to pieces originally because once I was diagnosed by, with bipolar, I wanted to get more information. I read a lot of books that uh, other people wrote, and I never found my story. And once I started, I realized there's a lot of other points in my life that were important and were tied to bipolar. There was addiction, love addiction, um, and then there's a whole other side that's rock and roll and on the road. First met Scott Weiland through a modeling agency that I was working with, and he was hired to drive me on my appointments and drive me to jobs because I was 16 at the time and I didn't have a license. And we began a friendship, and it was prior to his getting a record deal. And um, it kind of took off from there. First as a friendship, then as some version of a love affair, and then it moved into a marriage and uh, having children. I first started drinking uh, when I was 13 years old, and it wasn't really an issue for me uh, until I got into my early 20s. And when I got into my early 20s, I began drinking a lot. Depression was a huge factor in why I drank. And Scott and I, once we got into a deep relationship, I took on his drug habits, and uh, we ended up using heavily heroin and cocaine for a good year of my life, and I was in and out of rehabs. And it took a long time, it took a really long time for us to get better. And uh, I'm really grateful that I was able to dig my way out of that hole. And I wouldn't give up the last 31 years and all the tragedy that occurred in those 31 years. Um, because I, I love where I am now and I appreciate it.